Assalamualaikum and hi. This is frequency response likely compensated design using MATLAB. So this is the editor part where we can uh, write our coding in MATLAB to calculate anything. So in this case, we are referring to frequency response design using likely compensator. Based on step number one, we determine uh, the first one is from the percent of overshoot given in the design requirement. We determine the damping ratio based on this uh, formula of uh, percent of overshoot to determine the damping ratio. So, first we write uh, on the left side, we can determine any variable for our value given in the design requirement. In my case, I use POS, percent of overshoot. Uh, given in the question, let's say 15%, so I just write 15. And then this is a uh, peak time given in the design requirement. I label as TP equal to 0.3. Uh, you do not need to write the unit. And Another design requirement is correction factor. I label as CF equal to 10. So the next one is I need to determine a damping ratio from this percent overshoot, overshoot using this formula. I label the damping ratio as Z equal to this one. In this case, ln has been replaced by log in MATLAB coding. So the rest is equal to this formula. And the next one is I determine the um, from damping ratio and peak time or setting time value, we can determine the required bandwidth frequency. So this one is based on this formula from peak time. So pi has been replaced what with PI. Okay, this is the coding in MATLAB. The rest is equal to this one. This is how we write the square root function. This is how we write the Z squared. This one, the damping ratio has been labeled by Z. So I use Z in this one and this is how we write the Z squared and this one for square root function. Okay, square root, square root. For multiply, we need to use star. The rest is uh, this one for uh, division and the rest is we need to use proper bracket. Step two, determine the unknown gain K from static error constant given. So in this case, the given desired velocity static error constant is 255. And then, for example, if I have a numerator, uh, in terms of polynomial, I write the value of 0, negative 2. And then the next one, I determine the denominator in terms of polynomial function in MATLAB coding. I write the... Uh, Poles as 0, negative 14, negative 17, and negative 32. This is the value of poles. And then this is the coding in MATLAB in order to determine, to convert this 0 and pole at the numerator and denominator in terms of transfer function in S domain. And then the next one is, uh, I determine the unknown gain K in the question. Okay, so... This is uh, the transfer function in zero pull and gain format. This is the answer for damping ratio based on this formula. The value is 0 0.5169. Required bandwidth frequency based on peak time is 15.3215 seconds. Okay, so the gain, the unknown gain K for step two is. 277,440 and this is um, this is the overall transfer function with the gain uh, K that has been determined earlier. This is the zero uh, at the numerator which is negative 2 here and then this is uh, the poles at the numerator 0, negative 32, negative 17, negative 4 equal to this one. Okay, the next one we continue uh, the other step in the next video. Thank you.